The American Society of Gene and Cell Therapy is a nonprofit organization dedicated to discovering and developing gene and cell therapies to fight disease. And many of our members are scientists who have spent years researching messenger RNA biology and its potential use in vaccines. Vaccines prevent illnesses, save countless lives, and have greatly reduced or eliminated several diseases. But what is an mRNA vaccine? And how does it work against the virus that causes COVID-19? Well, mRNAs are molecules within the body that contain genetic instructions for cells to make various proteins that are required for the body to function properly. mRNA vaccines deliver synthetic mRNA molecules into cells, instructing them to make antigens. An antigen is typically a foreign invader that the immune system recognizes as not being part of itself, such as the protein surface of a virus. For the COVID-19 vaccine, cells are instructed to only make the SARS-CoV-2 spike protein, which is just enough to activate the immune system. But the cells are not given enough instructions to build the full virus, so the vaccine cannot cause COVID-19. These antigens then trigger the immune system to produce specific protective antibodies that neutralize the virus. In this case, the antibodies needed to fight COVID-19. If a person is exposed to SARS-CoV-2, the immune system will detect the familiar antigens and produce antibodies to attack them. A vaccinated person's immune system can better defend against the infection altogether or greatly reduce the severity of the infection. An mRNA vaccine for COVID-19 requires two doses, three to four weeks apart, to be effective. mRNA vaccines are cost-effective and quick to manufacture, expanding access to more people. Now, let's talk about the creation of mRNA vaccines for COVID-19. First, it's important to know that mRNA vaccines have been researched for the last 20 years with the hopes of fighting diseases such as cancer, rabies, Ebola, and the Zika virus. So the research was ready to be applied to this new virus. All COVID-19 vaccines are studied in clinical trials and are strictly reviewed by an agency that oversees medical products. In the United States, this is done by the Food and Drug Administration, known as the FDA. Clinical trials study how a treatment interacts with the body and if it is safe and effective before it can be made available to the public. It's true that COVID-19 vaccines have been developed with record-setting speed, but that doesn't mean they aren't held to the same safety and efficacy standards as other treatments. Clinical trials may take years, but the FDA has pathways and programs in place to accelerate the development of drugs or therapies that treat or prevent serious diseases and public health emergencies. Trial results have been positive. Here to explain more is ASGCT President, Dr. Stephen Russell. During the course of clinical trials, mRNA vaccines have been shown to reduce the risk of adults getting COVID-19 by over 90% and to virtually eliminate the risk of severe disease. Importantly, there were also no significant safety concerns in these clinical trials. COVID-19 has cast a dark cloud over our world, disrupting, changing, and ending lives. This is a virus that we need to fight together. And if enough people receive vaccines, it will build protection against the virus in our communities. For more information on the mRNA vaccine, visit patienteducation.asgct.org.